Hey everybody, the Bong is here and welcome to my first taste test video in as many, many months. In fact, I had a couple videos already done this year and I was using the uh, laptop camera and for some reason the color just kept fluctuating randomly and I didn't like how it turned out. So because of that, I went and got myself a tripod from my phone and I did get a new phone not that long ago and which has a much better camera and obviously much more space than the previous one had so without further ado i'm going to be using that camera to record these so here is the uh, first thing that I'm, I'm going to be trying in as many months i'll try to do these regularly i can't guarantee it the uh, stouffer's lean cuisine fit wraps Obviously, it's going to be in reverse. I do apologize for that. So, there were two different kinds. I think they were under $3 each. There was the buffalo chicken one, which I'm trying right now. And the other one is teriyaki chicken. There might have been other kinds, but that was the only two they carried where I got them. So, you put this in the microwave for like one minute on each side. Then you let it rest so that you can actually grab it. And I don't know why they call it fit wraps because, well, the sodium you're going to get for the buffalo sauce alone is going to undo a good bit of that. About 670 milligrams if you're health conscious about that. And there's also 0.1 grams of trans fats. Not very promising already. But right now that's not about like uh, how healthy it is for you because obviously it's not the best thing you should have every day. How does it taste? Well, here it is right there. It's still a bit hot to the touch. But let's hope the insides don't burn me alive. Mm. Obviously, all I got was like tortilla because I only got to this far. But it has like brown rice, chicken, of course carrots, celery, and red onions. So we haven't even gotten to the filling yet. I think I might be able to with this bite. Well, you can certainly feel the heat that comes in a few seconds later from the buffalo sauce. And the carrots are not too spicy or too crunchy. So, at least the vegetables are quite cooked in there. Let me see if I can get to some chicken. You know, it's not that bad. It's like white meat chicken, as you can see. So it's not going to be completely fatty. And it's not dry either, which is good. Like, I'm just feeling the texture right now. There's still a little bit of juiciness to it. The rice doesn't even look that brown, though. Kind of looks like white rice. Maybe I'm just seeing things wrong. But it doesn't look brown to me. All right, let me take one more bite. Mm. I mean, it makes sense why there's carrots and celery in there, because you know, if you're thinking buffalo wings, usually you have carrots and celery with it. Never understood why they added red onions though, but they're not that bad. I mean, the slices are small enough. Oh, how did that piece get out of there? It must have spilled out from the other side. But in any case, I, the red onions, are they're small enough so they don't overpower. And usually when they're cooked up, they're less pungent. But yeah, that's how the filling looks on that side. 
There's more of it on the opposite side of which I ate from. Now let me take one more bite. So yeah, if you like a uh, buffalo chicken anything, you'll definitely enjoy these wraps. Of course, like, obviously they're not going to be that healthy for you because of the sodium and the buffalo sauce alone. But if you feel like it's too spicy, maybe have a little bit of sour cream on the side, and you'll definitely enjoy this. So, I'd say out of a 10, I would give this maybe... A 7.5 like it's really good that the filling works I can say that the brown rice does not look that brown it looks like white rice but that's like a minor nitpick for me I, I don't worry that much about what kind of rice it is as long as it's cooked who knows maybe I'll try the teriyaki chicken in a future video and we'll see how it compares but until then, you take it easy and uh, enjoy the rest of your day.